Hello my Trishiest Officious, welcome back to my channel and first of all, this picture of Mariah, she is insanely drunk in this and I just love it so much, I love identifying with it, the fact she's wearing lingerie to a nightclub, everything about this picture is mwah. Allegedly Bear is back, my Halloween costume just arrived, let's just say I'll be doing what's right this Halloween. <laughs> I'm so petty. And we are going to be talking about the Ace family. Now, I am pouring a Red Bull because I am going to have to watch a video in which it upsets me. Now, if you don't know who the Ace family are, congratulations and I wish I was you. Honestly, my life was a lot happier when I wasn't aware of them. Uh, they are a family channel and my opinion of family channels, especially the older I fucking get, is that they are scum. Point blank period. They shouldn't exist. I'm not for restricting what people post online and I'm very a freedom of speech. This is from a person who their channel is about freedom of speech and saying what they think, whatever. But I believe that when it comes to family channels, they there should be, from YouTube's point of view, a little bit more care provided than just turning off YouTube comments. Remember the full scandal where it was basically being exposed that the main watchers of family channels on YouTube were and YouTube responded by turning off the comment and creating a new section when uploading videos called made for kids or not made for kids and my videos are not made for kids and basically it just means that the comments and you can't really interact with it in that way. Is that enough? Because I saw something today and it made me very angry. This is unrelated towards Ace Family but it is actually about the Ballinger family. And they were a channel that I enjoyed watching. I still I have nothing bad to say about them, but I'll keep up my same energy whenever it comes to talking about family channels. Someone sent me something today because they knew I was gonna talk about the Ace family and one of the children in the Ballinger family's vlogs, the main search whenever you type up their name on Google is their name and then their feet. Like name, blank blanks, feet. And It's like, who's the responsibility on there? It makes me feel really weird. And then on another family channel we're going to talk about, because we're going to talk about them all, the Sakuni Jolies, the same thing happened with their youngest daughter in Google search. And it's like, these are the things that people are typing in, so much so that it's being suggested. Like the autofill. And there's a full talk, we'll, we'll watch the clip, but there's a full talk with Ace Family, with all of these different family channels, there are so many, there are so many, that where's the consent? Because obviously your children really can't consent to having every single moment posted online until they're at least 18. You know what I mean? And it's like, these family channels in general, especially Ace Family, I'm gonna go back to focusing on them now, they use their kids' tantrums, being upset, scaring them, bad events in their life, and good events as clickbait. And it's like, how is the child supposed to feel whenever they're 18 and they go online and their temper tantrums were used as clickbait, seen by millions of people? And aside from that, more intimate moments. Now, we all love home videos. We all love looking back at, oh my god, look at look at me when I was young, whatever. I'm glad that mine aren't on the internet. I, I'm not saying they're embarrassing, but I'm just saying I look at that like that's a kid. Even though it's still me, I watch these videos, these home videos that my mom and dad recorded and put on DVDs for us to watch, you know, now. And it's super sweet. I'm loving looking back on them, but I'm still looking at it like that's a child. That is literally a toddler or that is a baby looking at myself. And I'm like, there's no way that I would feel good if this was my content. Like this was my money source. Your money source is your child. And it's like, it poses the question and there's a debate online that drama channels, no, not drama channels, sorry, family channels, and ones that say they aren't family channels, but say that they wouldn't, you know, show their kids whenever they're born and they wouldn't make their content about their kids, but then did the exact same thing, you know, whenever it happened, they made their entire channel about their kids because that gets views. It poses the question that is more kids than just more views. You know what I mean? If the first kid's not getting as many views anymore, ah, another one. And now Angelica, 
actually, you know the drama channel? Love Angelica, babe. She is so incredibly sweet to me. Anyway, Angelica did a tweet ages ago about Sukuni Jolies and it was like, oh, is this the family that, you know, pop out kids whenever they're down in views? Something along those lines. And it really is a conversation that needs to happen. These families' views and income is based on the children. So if the children express discomfort with being on the internet, oh, well, that's our income. Sorry, love. You need to... You know what I mean? And that feels really weird to me. So what happened was the Ace family can expose themselves. They started their vlog in a really weird way. Now, another thing with family channels is they show such a happy persona all the time, which you know throughout any family is not really the case, but it's overly forced. So whenever that, you know, mask falls, it's quite scary to a lot of the viewers, especially because a lot of viewers of family channels are young kids as well. And then there's a whole other genre of people who watch these videos. I am working on a video and I have been for the longest time just because I want to call people out and I want to, you know, show clips and it's, it's messy the one I've been working on. I actually have a video on drama, <laughs> oh my god, family channels and calling different ones out. Um, kind of like the ones I talked about in this video and using different case studies if you want, if you will. And I haven't posted the video because it's, it's extreme. So. However, this was how the vlog started for the Ace family. So imagine just the sheer panic that was running through them whenever they posted this accidentally. But there's also a conspiracy theory that this was the first ever vlog that she ended, the wife, instead of him. And this is the first vlog that shows him being aggressive. And a lot of people believe she did this on purpose. So let's watch it and see. Hey, Ace family! Welcome back to our channel, guys. What's going on, no. Good thing I don't have to. No, I'm gonna say it. Good thing I don't have to be on camera today. Okay. God. Okay. My hair looks fucked up. I'm not feeling like this. So just go. Okay. Okay, one, two, three. Hey, hey family. family! Welcome back to our channel, guys. What's going on? Every. Ooh, look at my hair. Good thing I'm not gonna be on camera today. I'm gonna be. Hey! <sighs> There's a lot to focus on in this video. Obviously, him being aggressive, and how quickly she turns the camera whenever he, sh you know, shifts. And also, how the children are almost trained to, ah, stop, ah, whenever they say to film again. I don't know the names of these children, but the one on the far left, whenever they're like, oh, stop recording, she drops the act, and then whenever they start again, she's so happy and, you know, saying, Hey, Ace Fam, and it's like, this is what's taught to the children. And I don't think that's, personally, something you should be instilling in your children, especially at a young age. Let's watch it one more time now that you know what I've said. Ace Fam! Welcome back to our channel, guys. What's going on, everybody? Look at my hair. No. Good thing I don't have to. No, I'm gonna say it. Good thing I don't have to be on camera today. Okay. God. Okay. My hair looks fucked up. I'm not feeling okay. like this. So just go. Watch. Okay, okay one, two, three. Hey, 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 I really don't agree with family channels, and the thing was, whenever I, uh, I used to watch um, a couple Sukuni Jolie vlogs as well, and especially the Ballinger family, um, they would do family vlogs, and I used to watch them a lot whenever I was younger, and I think just the older you get, the more you kind of imagine what the future of the children is going to be like, and it's like, oh yeah, they're set up with money, but then are they? Because, you, but here's the thing, they may, and that may not be an issue. But then also, it's like, they do they have a say, and then they say that they have a say, and then they, 
And like, can they grasp a say until they're at least 18 and like a legal adult? I, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Anyways, on the Ace Family, they actually address this in their next vlog, making fun of it. Mm -hmm. Welcome back to our channel, guys. Oh, goodness. What? My hair's really... Where did you fuck up? Babe. Can I... Can I just do my hair really quick, please? No. No, you gotta film right now. Babe, pretty please. Let me just... Oh, still is crying. Do you have to sit down? No. Then, oh, We're just, filming right now. I'll just go right over to the sink and now. do it really quick. Now. Is this symbolism that they just think of their children as props? Please, pretty please, I'll do anything for you. Just let me fix my hair. I don't want to look like this on camera. Please. This is weird. This is weird behavior. This is weird. <laughs> well, let me go and just do it real quick. It's little the sinks right here. Give me, give me a kiss before I go, please. Thank you, be there. This is weird. What do you say? Huh? What did you say? I said, go ahead. <laughs> As some of you guys know, this is weird. I recently uploaded a video, A Day in the Life of Catherine, and there was a clip in there that was not supposed to be uploaded. It was not supposed to be in there. I accidentally left it in there. I edited This is weird. It's like she's reading a script and he's like, yep, don't mess it up. Video when you, you guys know. You on purpose. You guys, oh my god, I just had deja vu this weird. I was editing the video. You guys know that Austin has been editing the video since day one. So it's weird that the first one that she edits, she includes this clip. And basically, we just want to talk about that for a second. So pretty much, um, it was a rough morning that morning, and we were frustrated with each other. We were arguing. And, and obviously, they only saw a clip of that. Yeah, you guys only saw the, a small clip of it. You guys this is weird. <laughs> this is weird. You guys didn't actually see me yelling before, thank God. <laughs> Make me so awkward and so uncomfortable, and maybe like, <laughs> and that was like take four. And at that point, I was so frustrated, and I didn't like how it was going because it was my video that I wanted to do. And yeah, at the we, end, we had the babies. Yeah, and at the end, he was like, "My hair is fucked up. Like, really I would was. not be filming like this." And I was like, oh, "Okay." And at that point, it was like the fourth try, and I was so over it. And. The I was the one that this is weird. This is weird. This is weird. And it just so happened to make it in the video. <laughs> and that's like just y'all laugh at truth. Um, but I will say that Austin. They said you were crying. They said you were crying before that. Were you crying? No, I wasn't crying. <laughs> they said you I, had a bruise on your forehead. Stop it. That's what they said. Stop it. <laughs> You're lying. Oh my god, making fun of abuse. This is so hilarious. No. These people have 19.1 million subscribers. <laughs> no, stop. Okay, so listen. People are crazy. No, listen. No, we always argue. Okay, something that you guys don't know is that recently, pretty recently, I want to say like just a couple months ago, there was a period where Austin and I didn't talk for four days. We didn't talk. <gasps> wow. For four. So basically, I Austin love this is part. The villain. He's always been the villain. I guess. Oh, one thing I want to say is stop believing too. everything you freaking hear. Like, if somebody can be monetized, like, accusing someone of something, like, obviously... You mean, like, using the Ace name? Yeah, like, people oh, using their name. Every day. I know, I'm just saying, like, if you can be monetized, then... If the person's monetized, just probably not believe it. Because... Perfect! Okay, so let's only believe news, everyone, that isn't monetized. So just if some random person on the street writes the news, let's believe that more, okay? Thank you, Catherine. Thank you, Austin. Wonderful video. <laughs> Y'all are weird. Okay, guys, so what's your opinion of this, and what do you think about them responding to it and almost making a joke of it? I mean, this is... this is weird. I hate family channels, <laughs> and just the fact that even just symbolism of, oh my god, look at the children as props as well, is like, do they understand how tone deaf this is? I don't like this, I don't like this at all. Let me know what your opinion is. They're receiving a lot of backlash for this. Let me know, but guys, don't believe me, I'm monetized, this channel's monetized, don't believe me. Only believe unmonetized people. That's how it works.
Anyways, I'll see you. Please, let's have a conversation. What do you think about this? It's weird. Allegedly. Hmm.